Kylie Jenner becomes the youngest billionaire ever, but apparently she almost didn't make the mark. David Dobrik hangs out with the Kardashians and has an epic fall, ouch. Plus, Kris Jenner does an awesome promo for Captain Marvel. Hey guys, it's Allie for Hollywood Life, and while we shout out members on our channel, we decided to do one for free for those who commented a funny sitcom name on this photo we posted. So stay tuned to the end for that. But okay, let's talk about Momager Kris Jenner because she just did this awesome Captain Marvel promo with Lisa Rinna. I think there's a woman in there. Well, help her. I'm an actress, not a doctor. Besides, I don't think she needs any help. What she needs is her own movie. I feel like Kris Jenner legit carries a phone like that at all times. But okay, moving on to the legend Anna Wintour, as she just did a video with Vogue and revealed her thoughts on the Jenner clan, and it's pretty awesome. She calls Kris Jenner a creative genius and doesn't know how the family lives in the public eye so much. Considering Anna wears shades indoors half the time, I get where she's coming from. Anna also thinks that Kim changed the most out of all of them and is now more minimalist. She also says Kim has been covering up more over the years, but I think that one's debatable. In regards to Kendall, she gives her a lot of credit for her modeling success and persevering all of these years. Anna Wintour is a legend and I want to be invited to the Met Gala, even if it's just a press pass. Ooh. Do you want to come or not? But all right, briefly to Kendall Jenner's love life, Us Weekly reports she and Ben Simmons are becoming more serious, but not so serious to the point where an engagement would suddenly happen. That makes sense. The site claims they spend a lot of time together and she loves going to his games to support him and even sits next to his mom sometimes. So sweet. Now to Kylie Jenner, the lip kit mogul is now officially, wait for it, a billionaire. Finally! At 21 years old, Kylie officially dethroned Mark Zuckerberg as the youngest person ever to hit the 10 digit mark. He was 23 at the time. Kylie reacted to the news telling Forbes, I didn't expect anything. I did not foresee the future, but the recognition feels really good. That's a nice pat on the back. Kylie, of course, credits this milestone to her huge social media following, but there is more. Forbes reports Kylie's decision to go from selling online to in-store with Ulta made a significant difference. Apparently, her sales were hitting a slump at one point until she partnered up with the store. When doing so, kids who were not able to buy online with credit cards could go in stores and buy the products. There are also so many people who wanted to physically touch or see the products before buying. Another interesting note, Forbes reports Ulta barely spent any money on marketing Kylie's products, so clearly the relationship works great both ways. Solid marketing and distribution, a match made in makeup heaven. And what better way to celebrate all of this than to go roller skating with your family and new YouTube buddy David Dobrik, who apparently Ooh. ate it at one point. Ouch. But also good vlog content. But all right, enough news to the caption contest shout outs. Here are some of my favorite crew names. Diogo named us the Hollywood Life Party Crew. Clever. Shauna called us the Big T Theory. I'm dead. Lauren Laughs called us the best of the worst. True. Killian called us Beverly Hills 90T10. Very clever as well. But my favorite comes from this user, Diana? Question mark. That doesn't make sense. I don't know why I like that one but I do. Check out the other awesome names in the community tab, but all right, hit the sub, like, and bell button for all the latest on your favorite news. Bye, guys.